Hey, this is Moo. Welcome back to Sins of Bad Empire Management. Um, we've just recovered here, but now we're still in a precarious position. We don't have any obvious targets to go after. I suppose red would be the most inviting. Um, hmm. Oh, they're all heading off that way. And we have not really a whole lot of resources available here. And Excellent. <laughs> way too many points to defend. But I think I've got to blockade this wormhole if I'm going to think about doing anything else. So let's take a look at our fleet. We'll cooperate with your scheme for now. I'm missing one Javelis frigate from those last couple of fights. So I'm going to build that. And I am going to need... Yep. I'm going to need a Rellos. And when these, guy, when these guys are built and they catch up to my main fleet here... Copy that, TACCOM. Okay, he's still researching. When they all, all catch up, I'm going to move everyone up to this wormhole. Uh, fight who, whoever is here for control of it. I think it's probably going to be purple, because this is purple's main way in. You can see he's got, like, the other end of the wormhole here. Build a starbase sitting right on top of the wormhole. And hopefully that will deter uh, guys jumping through and jumping back. Maybe it won't. Maybe it'll die but kill, like, half of one of his fleets on the way to us, which is also good. And maybe our fleet will sit on top of it and just steal experience. Which is also... These are all good results. Alright, looks like I lost a scout. And I'm also... Lacking research. So let's queue up a little bit of research. Allied forces are being attacked. Yeah, I forgot to finish this off. That was dumb. Phase jump complete. Um... And now, I, I, yeah, I'm going to look into these upgrades for star bases since I'm actually building star bases now. And unbreachable hull is going to be pretty important. Eventually, I'll need all of these, but let's start with unbreachable hull just because my economy is so poor. I want to avoid losing any star bases if I can possibly avoid it. You seek the unity's favor. What do you want? Yeah. Uh, let me get another level of unbreachable hull, I guess. I'll research both of those, then I'll have to get those two. And unfortunately, I'm also going to have to start building a larger fleet. I say unfortunately because like, you would think a larger fleet would be good, but... My tax rate right now is 19%. When I go to the next level... Uh, it's going to go to 28%, and then it's going to go to 38%, and my economy is really weak. It's going to be very difficult for me to support, support any reasonable fleet. Okay, my Rollos is built, and he's about to cross up here, and hmm, I'm going to send a scout, which I'll probably lose, but that's okay, that's what they're for. Scout go here, and then come back. So I've just told the scout to jump over here. Um, I'll see what's happening at the wormhole. And if he doesn't get killed, then he'll just go back and rejoin the fleet. I have a feeling that uh, the engines are not going to be not going to be really happy with me shortly. Because if my guess is right, there's going to be a fair number of them right here. And I'm going to have to kill them in order to take control of that area. Let's see. Oh. Make it fast. That's good. Ready for and this is good. Sort of. Alright, yeah, there's attacked. a big fleet here. Research complete. Where's my scout? Okay, my I lucked out. My scout is really far away from their fleet. Where do you need me? But I am going to move in now. Let's see, what's he got? He has no capitals, a bunch of sentinels, uh, subcaps. Did he have any caps? No, he had no caps. So I'm going to move in there. 
And once I move in and get a better look at the situation... Um... Yeah, I wonder if I can do this now. Can I? Uh, yeah. You know what? I'm going to instruct him. I'm going to move him as close to the wormhole as possible, and he's going to build a star base there. In that way, anyone, any enemy ships that jump in and out of the wormhole will immediately come under fire. And I hope this works. Alright. Um, still researching some... Got enough research here for technology. I'm going to need this money to upgrade that starbase. But in the meantime, I'm going to build three scouts because my intel is way out of date on all these areas. Oh, man. I hope they don't kill him. Holy shit. No, don't kill him. Oh, that, oh, that was dumb. Why didn't I wait? I'm gonna lose this Rollos. Research complete. Go, 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 go. You can do it, dude. Oh no, no, I can't do it. He's gonna die. Oh, maybe not. I'm getting hull repairs. The rest of my fleet is in. I'm really messing with purple. Oh, and a bunch of them. Are they really? They're all. They all just ever attack this one skirmisher, or are they going back to the wormhole? I can't tell. Maybe they're reforming. Oh no! It looks like they're. No, they're they're wheeling about. Nothing to see here. Go on your bit. Go about your business. Come on. Research complete. Where do you need me? Good. Oh, I can't believe he's going to make it. Come on. Turn. Turn. You can... Turn. Come on. Oh, is it, I'm, it's slightly too close. Slightly too close. Build right there. Yay. I think it was right on the edge of the gravity well, and he couldn't build without actually falling into the wormhole. All right. Well, this is a good outcome. I think I forgot all about my scouts, so let's set them to actually go explore. Let's see what... I, I did lose something. What did I lose? Oh, I lost a cobalt. I lost a cobalt and something else. Didn't I? Sure looks like it. Oh, I was... I do have CLOs, and I have... Oh, hmm. I think I built too many, uh... Too many Kodiaks? No, I'm doing fine there. Alright, uh, let's see. So I lost a Cobalt. Preparing for phase jump. Um, I... It's not worth thinking about too much. I'm just gonna build a Cobalt. There. So now, um, this is good. This guy's under construction. I've got way superior forces here. Times have changed, and so have our goals. Now the guy whose ass I'm kicking is going to cancel his trade agreement. What a surprise that is. And I've paid for all my upgrades here. I just have to make sure that this guy does not die in the meantime. Because I I can't remember. I think I lose my money that I just spent if he dies before he's complete. Ooh, okay. Rapid manufacturing. Honestly, I like this more for building up new colonies than I do for actual in-combat use. In-combat, it's a little less than overwhelming... When you build up a new colony, it's totally priceless. Phase jump complete. All right. I can't forget to buy all this stuff. Research complete. Uh, 
Um, yeah, advanced maneuvering is not bad. I guess I'll just go for that as soon as I get enough money. And of course, again, I could sell some crystal to afford it, but I really hate selling crystal because it just it, it's just so hard to come by at certain points, and you need a lot of it. Wow. I'm still pretty impressed that that Rallo's made it through. I was I was sure I was going to have to build another one and wait for him to show up. That that would have sucked. Who am I fighting now? Oh, I'm not fighting anyone. It's, these guys are fighting each other. Alright, now that things have calmed down a little bit here. Did I build a cobalt to replace the... Yeah, I did. Um, Alright, these guys seem all up to date. Uh, I do have enough javelins. Usually I lose a javelin in those fights. Uh, this guy is building upgrades... Now, I have to really think about... <clears throat> I mean, at this point, I would just start dropping star bases all, all over the place, but... I mean, look at this terrible setup. I have a real problem now, because I can't really afford... I mean, I could build... I could start building star bases, which means I'm doing almost nothing else. Or... I could build a larger fleet and start attacking in this direction, which means I'm like... I mean, not only am I going to be spending money on the fleet, but my tax rate is going to go up pretty significantly, and I'll lose even more money here. And then I can't build star bases anyway. <clears throat> it's kind of a <coughs> it's kind of a precarious situation economically. But you know the. The more I think about it, the, the Argon of Starbase really is one of the best things about the tech, so I think I'm probably better off if I do go all in on Starbases. So, sorry if I'm taking kind of like the, the boring route. I'm just going to let, you know what? Fine, I'm the pirate target, because a couple of nice things will happen. First is that in order to get to these planets... And I think that one, two, he's got three plans that he could go for, and they're all equidistant from the pirate plant. But in order to get to any of them, except I guess for this one, uh, it's most likely that he's going to move in this direction, which means that he'll be intercepted by red at this planet. And then he's going to wind up down here. Start building here. He'll be intercepted by red, and if he's intercepted by red, there's a possibility that he'll kill a bunch of his trade ships, at least. And then, I mean, I'm not really worried about pirates at this point. I could just, you know, eat them for breakfast. So, I'm just going to let them attack me. That's fine. In a way, it's, it's sad, because it's possible that red could actually kill all the pirates by himself, just with his defenses. I mean, he has an Orculus here, and then I wouldn't get any experience, but... Uh... With my economics as bad as they are right now, I'm not going to spend any money on Bounty Wars. It's totally not worth it. I will, however, spend some more money on research. Here, I'll do that because I have scouts running around again, and I want them to get what they're going. Um, this is kind of worthless for me, but... I'll just use it because I'm filling in the blanks. I don't want to have to worry about whether or not I bought that technology later. Allied forces are being attacked. I'm going to speed this up because now I'm just waiting for Rallos to move. Okay. Research complete. Looks like I lost two of my scouts. I don't even know where they went. Research oh, it's because they're all flying up here. Now I'm going to lose my last scout. Good job. Let's wait for this guy to move in. Oh. Mm. Then I suppose I'll build another Rallos at the same place, as soon as it's available. As soon as that guy builds, I'll free up the command points, and I'll just do that. Yep. Alright, let's go back here. 
So this guy sitting on stack defenses, this is his most important ability now because it's going to heal and recharge all of these structures, and they'll heal and recharge him. You know, it'll be a, just a big happy circle jerk of unlimited repairs and power. So that's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then I'll build fighters because I don't want to think about it later. Um, then I'm going to build up structural integrity and then the guns. But, let's see. Yeah, I have extra squads to deploy here. Now I have a Relazor here. He's going to move in this direction. Reinforce there. If I have enough money at that point. I guess, it, you know, as boring as it is, it does make more sense to build the star bases than to build up the fleet. Because at least... Like, the star bases are super expensive, but they don't cut my permanent income. Like fleet, like uh, fleet logistics do. Alright, once he's built there, then I guess I'll set up a star base here, and then I'll have to build one here. Originally I was going to ignore those, but I... This terrain is so junky that they're going to have to move... Oh, there's a pirate reaper here. Is that That's really, that's the only guy that was left. Hmm. I guess he did get his ass kicked by Red. There's like one pirate ship left, and he's going to die to a couple of fighters. Good. Structure complete. All results are good. Um, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, and then I'll need one more point in weapon systems here. Alright, this guy's on track to be fully upgraded. Now I'm just going to wait for this guy, and there he goes. And now I don't have any money. Typical. Question is, do I establish those star bases and then uh, kind of piecemeal upgrade the, uh, them? He's running out. I guess that makes more sense, except that I'm kind of a scatterbrain. And I don't want to have to keep jumping around between these star bases to see which ones I've upgraded. Allied forces are being attacked. Ah, screw it. Here. As soon as you had enough money, you build one. That's fine. This is really a bad. I'm in. Uh, I'm not really used to my economy being this bad. I suppose from the last game, I should be, since I was losing planets all over the place, but. Um, I mean, like any 4X game, normally you hit a point where you've got economic saturation and you can just buy everything you need. And that really hasn't happened this game because my my layout is so bad. Which is why, I'm sorry, Corsola Armada, I will be moving in on you. At some point in the near future, he's down to 20 already, so he should be breaking his ceasefire pretty soon. Um, is he still under construction? He is. Not for long, though. Structure complete. All right. Um, let's just start defending like crazy over here. And then I'm going to build a defense. I guess, you know what? I really need the defense up here. This need, this planet, even though it's less valuable, needs the defense more. Apparently my fleet's under attack somewhere. Probably a scout getting killed. Ugh. This is really quite painful. Um, let's see. So then I have to build another base to defend this planet. And then if I was really being nitty, I would take these as well. But I'm going to gamble that I don't need to. It could be a bad gamble. I, I'm going to fill in those blanks later. Since I'm partially protected. 
by having a starbase at the wormhole? Not really, though. But I'm going to have to build a starbase here and probably here just because I've got wormhole problems there. This is a... There are so many crappy little anomalies down here. It, it makes it very difficult to isolate to isolate myself in a little corner, which is what I like to do in this sort of a setup. Alright, this guy is jumping in and he'll be building a starbase pretty soon. I'm just going to let him do that. So I can spend the money on the other starbase and then stop thinking about it. What do I have to do? Whatever. Um, okay. Huh. Barely had enough money for the upgraded docking booms. Alright, I have to build one starbase here. And... Uh, man. Then I'm going to have to either build a Rollos or expand my fleet here. So I could do something about... So I can do something about red. I guess I can send a scout. Do I have both my scouts? Yes, I do. I guess I don't really need to, since technically they're allied with me until I, until I go turncoat on them. I'll do that anyway. Back here. On my way. You put a sensor there. And come back. Other oh, scout. What do you need to know? What did you put a sensor on? Intel put a sensor. You bothered to put a sensor on the wormhole where my entire fleet is and my star base is. You're freaking amazing. Alright, Rawls, where are you? There you are. The price on our head has increased. Whatever. Our fleet is under attack. Pirate raiders are on the loose. No, the pirates are after me. And here comes this starbase. You know, I might, depending on how quickly I move, probably not quickly at all, uh, I might even be able to finish that quest. All right, that's an Orculus, but it's not full. It's not even close to fully upgraded. I mean, it's got all three weapon systems, which will be a problem. Um, uh, yeah, screw it. I'm going to need more capital ships, though. So, let's see. This is two more capital ships. If I research this... Uh, it'll give me 150 extra supply, so I'll be able to build those ships and maybe some extras, but not really. Allied forces are being attacked. Probably just enough to build those capital ships. I'd have to go to the 30% mark to go whole hog. Which I might do as well. How are my upgrades like here? And I think I actually bought upgrades for this, this guy. Yeah, I did. That was before I realized how poor I was. This starbase was like built in the dot com boom. Uh, patience for such failure is running out. Fighters and one level of armor. Squadron checking in. No money. Structure no completed. crystal. Fighters. Man, I am so poor. Um, okay. Fighters. There. Oh! Look, it's, uh... It's a pirate raiders. They managed to get through without a scratch. Thanks, good buddy. 
I hope at least they cleared out some of these mines. I suppose I shouldn't really be mad at Red. I mean, sometimes I'll see pirate raiders that are heading for a, quote, ally heading through one of my systems, and I'll actually group my fighters and just run them in circles around my structures so that they don't kill any of the incoming raiders. Am I going to make it here in time to even mess with these guys? Probably not. At least I'll be able to see where they go. Research complete. Recruiting propaganda finished. Uh, now I have to be able to support those ships. So I'll do that. And I'm going to have to save up a little bit of money so I can actually buy the damn things. Which is going to be a little bit difficult since I'm so bad at money management. Okay, so I can build a Dunov and then when I get enough money I will build a coal. Did they already leave? Oh, they already left. Oh, man. Oh, wait, what, what direction are they going in? Uh, looks like they're headed right for Borkatova. Ahead slow. All hands, prepare for phase jump. Whatever. Uh, they're going to get their asses kicked on the way, though. They're taking a lot of damage. They're being fired on by a fully upgraded starbase. And once they get here, they're going to find another starbase waiting for them, which is going to mess with their structure. Yeah, I'll do a little more upgrading there. Um... Why am I even spending money on those upgrades? Combat I shouldn't be doing that. I really just need the money for... Uh, I need that money for ships. There was no reason for me to spend that money in this task. on that starbase. These pirates are dead anyway. Alright. Uh, there are exactly two planet bombers and they're about to die. Man, my fleet is so slow. Allied backup has arrived. All right, he's just started building, and so I'm going to queue this coal, and hopefully by the time the Dunov is complete, I'll have made enough money and or minerals so that I can pay for his upgrades. Oh, for... What are you waiting for? I ho he better not be waiting for this torpedo cruiser, because the torpedo cruisers Where do you need me? aren't even part Base of their fleet. On my mark. I have them grouped separately because they tend to do weird things on phase jumps. Uh, uh, man, there's like two guys left. A waste of time. Backup is joining the fight. Stunov's about out. Systems calibrated. That worked out well. And then the coal's gonna be out. A friendly fleet has arrived. And then I think I can yeah, then I should have enough to try and kill that Orculus and go to war with red. Come on, one more capital ship. What are you waiting? What are you doing? God, he's so slow. Here we go. That'll fix things. And the coal is out. That's good. 
We'll get him up to three. Everyone will be happy. I've got your back. Plotting jump coordinates. Here he goes. So, let's see. I suppose the proper thing to do is to take this one first. I'm going to need another... I am going to need another uh, Rellos. The proper thing to do is to take this Terran planner first. And then I can build the crazy amounts of defenses that I'm going to need. There's not really a single good direction to point these in. I mean... I'm sure I'm going to come under fire from over here. Um, pirates, I'm not even concerned. I suppose I have to put them facing in this direction. Since the wormhole still has access. And I lost all my scouts again. I'm going to build three more. Can I help you, Commander? Comlink active. If it's out there, I'll find it. Where to now? Good day, Commander. Point me in the right direction. So if these guys come out, I'll just right start assigning direction. them again to go and suicide themselves somewhere. Because apparently they're really bad at picking. Picking exploration targets. Come on, one more. If it's out there, yep. I'll find it. Uh, what am I? Now, what do I have to do? Uh, I guess I'll build up the things I'm going to need to survive this encounter coming up, and fill in the blanks here. Cash, survival. Pretty much the building blocks of any society cash and survival. If I was a smarter person, I'd also be upgrading those star bases, but man, I cannot afford it. Hmm. Where do you need me? Apparently there's a fight going on over here. I didn't even realize it. I don't know if it's really a fight. I'm not sure where this guy's going. He's wheeling around like I think he wants to dive back into the wormhole. So maybe I can catch him in time? Probably not as slow as these guys move. Alright, I still have a remote sensor here. He has no reinforcement fleet, so I just have to deal with that Orculus, which does a lot of damage. Wow. So I will be losing ships there. Oh, he's attacking. Good. That's good. I want him to attack. So, let me just make sure... In. That the first thing this guy does Hold steady. We're going in. is start ion bolting this guy so he doesn't run away. If he can get there in time. Oh, I might not even have to. I guess I didn't have to worry about that. I'm the target again. I'm not even going to worry about it. Reporting in. I'm going to immediately move in because I'm kind of sick of waiting. Because, you know, impatience is really the key to being a good field commander. But I'm going to move in on him and attack him next time. Thanks for watching.